we really wanted to play the octet, the super octet, and we've wanted to do it for a long time. Um, the four of us in the Kalino Quartet um, have always loved this piece. Um, and basically, we just asked people who we really love playing with. We love playing in this cathedral. It's a beautiful, beautiful venue. Uh, the sound is gorgeous, and it's also beautiful from an aesthetic point of view as a member of the audience to look out and enjoy the concert. <laughs> The Schubert Octet was written really um, was inspired by Beethoven's Septet for the same forces, but Schubert added an extra violin, and uh, it was a very successful format in its time. The amateurs played a lot of chain music amongst themselves, and the Beethoven Septet was ridiculously successful as Beethoven's most famous work when he was alive. And Schubert followed that model, as I say, adding an extra player to it, and expanding. He added an extra movement, and all the structurally it follows the same sort of things that Beethoven does, um, but also he used it as an exercise in orchestration. He, he was, had ambitions as a symphonist and wrote fantastic symphonies that were never performed in his lifetime, but he wrote the, the octet as an exercise towards his, um, his final symphony, the, uh, the great C major, to learn how to work instrument, wind instruments and strings together. So it's a glorious, glorious piece of music. You should come because it's one of the most amazing pieces that was ever written and because I think we all feel the same way about it, we're all very excited to play this unbelievable piece which is kind of new for some of us and really familiar for others, others of us and it's an amazing kind of unique experience I think to hear it, especially in, in this cathedral because the sound is just so magical.